Hi students, so there is an important and an official update coming for all of you as expected the GATE 2026 to be conducted by IIT Guwahati and yes officially the GATE 2026 will be conducted by IIT Guwahati only and as you know you know by July end or August first week we expect to the we expect the website to be uh, launched only that last year they launched the website quite early okay but yeah uh, you know uh, yeah, this year the, the, the website with the required details have been launched just today okay so let's know the important uh, updates coming up from the official website gate2026.iit.iitg.ac.in is the official website okay now let's first come to the important dates okay what are the dates mentioned here okay let, let's go to the dates okay okay so yeah, the uh, online application process will open on 25th of August, Monday. Okay, that is where the Go Apps portal will open. Okay, so right now you see this application portal, but uh, uh, it will not go to any landing page. So Go Apps will be live from 25th of August, the last date to fill up the online registration regular without any late fees. 25th October, sorry, 25th September. And as you know, every time they give up uh, extended date also, closing date of extended online registration October six with the late fee okay but why to delay the things uh, better you know fill it up as quickly as possible only okay so now gate 2026 examination okay is 7th and 8th february okay uh, you know and 14th and 15th february okay usually they keep first and second weekend but the first weekend is like uh, uh, the first february sunday so saturday goes to 31st january but i was expecting the dates of 31st january 1st february and 14 and 15 because of engineering services now here comes an important thing upsc has also announced the exam calendar and engineering services prelims for 2026 is also announced as of now on 8th february okay so uh, you know last year so what happened first gate notification gate website came and then upsc calendar came okay then eventually gate modified the dates but this time already upsc calendar is available and knowing that of iits have announced the date 7th 8th so whether they have uh, you know uh, discarded that thing or whether they are not aware i don't think they will not be aware i think i don't think they will not be unaware about the engineering services so still 8th february has kept or whether upsc will change the date we don't know but uh, something has to change because there are many aspirants citing gate and esc okay so 8th february esc prelims is also there okay so Otherwise, it is more or less expected the two weekends of February they have uh, chosen here. Okay, 7th, 8th and 14th and 15th. Okay, so uh, these, these are the important dates mentioned. Okay, now uh, coming to the gate papers. Okay, uh, gate 2026 test papers and syllabus they mention. Okay, you click on the uh, paper code to download the syllabus. But as of now, the syllabus is not uploaded. I guess because just recently the website is updated. Okay, so if you go to electronics and communication or if you select the paper code also, nothing is happening. Okay, but yeah, this is what you whenever it is available, you can download. Uh, will there be any syllabus change? Majorly no. Okay, mostly it is no. Uh, but yeah. Uh, every uh, you know five years or six years they are changing the syllabus 2016 there was a syllabus change by isc 2021 there was a syllabus change by iit bombay this is 2026 are they changing the syllabus maybe may not be chances are less but even if they change the syllabus there are minute changes it's not like a drastic change anyways 90 percent remains to be same only so that's not a big concern but yeah by chance if there is any update we'll let you know because right now i think they have not updated okay so yeah uh, of course again the gate can, you know, the student can fill up one or two uh, papers one or two forms okay so uh, the two paper combination are also not available as of now two paper combination to be updated soon they have clearly mentioned okay coming to the question paper pattern no change okay no change again computer based stairs three hours uh, 30 test paper okay uh, 30 test paper means 30 different uh, branches uh, which they, which i showed you in the earlier slide also now coming uh, okay uh, to the paper okay the pattern same three category of question mcq msq nat mcq only one option correct four options with only one option correct msq four options where one or more than one can be correct nat no options that's a numerical type question you have to fill in your answer in the uh, fill in the blank using the virtual keypad available okay uh, now uh, the pattern also remains to be same distribution of marks general aptitude 15 marks fixed as always mathematics 13 marks okay uh, except uh, you know uh, for xd which has the engineering mathematics of 15 marks okay and uh, technical the subject uh, is uh, 72 marks total 100 marks so there is no change here okay right 
so yeah questions again are either one mark or two mark you know you know the exact pattern also you know okay if i just tell you briefly okay this general aptitude 15 marks is 10 questions five question one mark five question two marks okay then this aptitude and technical this is total 85 marks okay which is divided into 55 questions 25 questions of one mark 30 questions of two marks so 25 into 1 plus 30 into 2 that is 85 okay so you know it anyways there is no change absolutely there is negative mark only for mcq for one mark minus 1 by 3 for two mark minus 2 by 3 for a wrong answer if you don't attempt there is no plus or minus there is no negative marking for msq okay or net question right there is no partial marking also in msq that you know right suppose in msq two options are correct a and b by chance you only chose a okay you chose the correct answer a but forgot but did not choose b will you get 50 percent marks no no partial marking only a and b if you choose all the correct options okay so there is no partial or there is no negative marking as well okay so exam patterns more or less remains to be same okay what else is there two paper i told you two paper uh, they have been updating soon examination schedule we discussed with the timings they have mentioned again 7th 8th 14th and 15th with the regular forenoon slot starting from 9 30 and afternoon slot starting from 2 30 pm three hours is the examination time okay which branch is going to fall on which date that is not mentioned as of now okay so as soon usually they will update it later only okay so uh, yeah whenever it is available we'll go through it okay so uh, this is what is the important details and then rest you know the eligibility criteria huh, there is a change here which is uh, you know uh, not usually uh, liked by students and that is the rise in the application fee okay yes it is 2000 okay it is 2000 okay it has increased this year and the application fee for regular period up to september 25 2000 if you fill with the extended late fee okay it's going to be 2500 clear right so uh, this is what is something okay uh, and of course if you are female scst pwd candidate it's going to be 1000 okay this is for single test paper of course you're choosing for two you have to pay the twice okay there is no uh, special discount there okay so these are all the details in the download section there is nothing there mostly they'll give some previous year papers in this download section okay so uh, yeah syllabus if i go once again let me check again no the syllabus is not updated maybe they are updating the files okay maybe uh, by late night or tomorrow we can expect but as i told you if by chance there is any syllabus change as uh, every five years usually they are changing okay 2010 i remember 2010 itself was the year where pattern was changed the 2010 was a syllabus change then 2016 then 2021 so let's see if they do any syllabus change okay so yeah that's it in fact 2010 is the year that was also conducted by iit guwahati where we saw major changes that year itself was aptitude was introduced and all those things but yeah pattern has not changed no uh, change in the pattern it remains to be 100 mark and the same number of questions will be there only thing is syllabus it's wait and watch okay but i'm telling you even if there is change it's usually 5 to 10 percent or below it only okay so don't majorly worry about it okay but yeah very soon uh, you know you should be able to get this uh, syllabus okay so uh, the syllabus exam pattern important dates application process application starts on 25th of august okay uh, yeah let me close the video by the same reminder 25th of august registration will is going to open right uh, of course uh, the exam dates have they have mentioned and also they have mentioned the announcement of results that is on march 19th that is on march 19th this anyways i have shown you okay so yeah anyways uh, somewhere around 15 to 20 march is the uh, official date they put up and the results are obviously available one or mostly one or two days before the official date most of the time okay dear so thank you and uh, yeah let's wait if there is any update on the syllabus okay if it remains to be same no problem you can just go and download it okay bye bye thank you stay safe and take care of yourself